in Venice. We're off to dinner. Here's a quick outfit check. So my bag is from Kurt and Keith. Uh, oh, sorry, Charles and Keith. Oh my God, I just bought a Kurt guy a bag. That's why I got confused. A Charles and Keith bag. Uh, my blazer is from Banana Republic. My tank top from Walmart. Pants are linen from H&M. And then the shoes is from Ralph Lauren. There is no makeup because I don't want to do skincare again when I get back from dinner. It's like almost 10 p.m. So no makeup. But yeah, that's the full look and I'll see you guys at dinner. <laughs>
We, I didn't plan anything because I knew we were going to be tired. We we're going to be traveling all day. It took us nine hours, almost 10 hours from Houston to Paris. And then an hour, 45 hours, two minutes from Houston, from Paris to Venice. And then we took a 25 minute um, vehicle, which you guys saw at the beginning. I didn't want any stress on this trip because it's his birthday. I didn't want us to have any stress. So I booked a taxi, a private driver to bring us straight to the plaza. And then we walked by foot. Don't do that. Um, I should listen to him. We could have taken a water taxi and bring us right to the apartment because we are on the lake, on the water. But I was like, oh, we could just walk. They said it was a five minute walk. It was a five minutes walk, but I don't know. I want to do that again. So you can take a taxi. Uh, we're staying at Airbnb. After this, I'll give you guys a little Airbnb tour. Um, I'm sitting in my the bedroom right now. It's a little messy, so you guys are not going to see the whole room, but I'm going to show you guys the Airbnb. And then after that, yeah, that's pretty much our day. Um, cooking with the chef, photo shoot, and then we come home, we pack, we get ready for Florence. So we're gonna spend the majority of our time in Florence and Tuscany. He loves Florence, I love Tuscany. So we're gonna spend the majority of our time in both city. Tuscany is about 45 minutes drive away from Florence, so which is perfect, we're just gonna stay in Florence. Uh, we we'll leave for Florence tomorrow morning, and then we stay there from the 4th to the 7th. So we're gonna spend three days in Florence and Tuscany. And then we're gonna come back to Venice. We we'll sleep one night on the 7th. Then we'll get back on the plane to Houston on the 8th. So that's why I said this is not technically our last day in, Flo uh, in Venice. But yeah, so I think I've talked too much. <laughs> I'm gonna pull out itinerary for every city in on the screen as we go. So last night, our first night, we didn't do anything because I didn't want us to do anything. So we rested, um, and then we slept. We Then we went for lit dinner on our own. We have no one with us. But today, we have back-to-back -back activities. So from the cooking class, which is for three hours, I think, it's from 10 to 2.30. From 10.30, 11.30, 4.30, 1.30, 2.30. So it's four hours thinking. And then the photo shoot is an hour and a half. So from 3.30 to 5. I think you're keeping us just sick. It's a long thing. So we have a whole day planned out and then we'll come home, pack, and get ready for Florence because we took the train tomorrow morning. So, but you'll see that on the screen, a screenshot of the peep of the activity so you can literally check that out. But yeah, let's do a quick Airbnb tour and then we'll go from there, okay? So I am starting off from in the master bedroom. Like I said, I'm not gonna show you the room because I need bed to have some type of privacy. So that is the main entrance. From this door you enter from here this is there's just an elevator and then they have, they have these little paintings of the globe on the wall I thought that was really cool and then they have a little book shelf area I thought that was cute but they don't have they have like information you can use to tour Venice but we don't need that we already scheduled everything we have guards and tours so we're good they have an in-home phone a uh, cell phone and then they have a little like nook area with seat where you can sit down. And then, then you walk right into the living room. And then I think this is what really made me book this place because it is right on the water, on the river. Hopefully I can open this door because I don't know how to do any of these Italian thing. He's been doing all of this. So yeah, that's... Our view. I haven't taken any photo yet though, and I don't have any clothes, but you can see the water. That's literally our view, which is so cool, which is so sick. There's a bridge, and then there's downstairs. This is so sick. It's a little cold this morning though. And then I'll close this, so I'll come back later. I'm like literally naked and standing on the people balcony. Be okay, all right, and then I'll come back to fix that. And then you leave from the living room, you go into the kitchen, the bathroom. He's in the bathroom, so you're not gonna see that. But this is a kitchen, it's so nice, it's so huge for a European kitchen, especially in Venice. Sorry, honey, you can go, you can come. I'm sorry, I'm recording on the other side. Sorry, um, but yeah, this is. I'm coming. 
Um, the kitchen, the bathroom is big and huge. And then this is our backyard. There's a little like a, hold on, why is this blurry? Yeah, I'm coming, let me fix the blur. There we go. And that is our backyard. It goes on, all the way down. Yep, from the kitchen. And they have everything pretty much in here. Um, he's out of the bathroom now, so y'all get to see. This is the washer and dryer. My stuff is everywhere. And then the bathroom. The only, my only problem with the bathroom is like the toilet. It's like the shower is extremely small, <laughs> but like it's big enough size. And then they have a blue dryer. This is me. Good morning again. <laughs> And then they have like the tower, one more thingy tower, standing dry. I thought that was pretty cool, yeah. And there's a lot of lights in here, so yeah, pretty much. I am hot, but I'm tired. We just walked 30 minutes to come to the market. So we're gonna shop and then go cook. <laughs> Justice. Yeah, the photo don't have a yes. Yes, it's so. so you need to discover when you come here. No? Yeah, <laughs> this is so cute. Oh, I'm excited. We're about to make good food. We got an apron and everything. Good, 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 good. Thank well, you. Prosecco, so we need three, three parts of, um, of the Prosecco, mm -hmm. two parts of Select. Okay. Ooh. Okay, you have this salad. Uh -huh. okay. We're gonna use this. Okay. And then we celebrate. Okay. <coughs> oh. one. In, for, in Venice, we, we drink, so you found this normally. Okay. Opera, really mm -hmm. famous, but this is this one is really typical in Venice. Okay. So to make the the spritz is Prosecco with select. Exactly. Ah, okay. oh, I didn't know that. I had it last The Prosecco Venetian, Venetian, Venetian um, mm -hmm. spritz is from select. Yes. Can you buy some here? Yeah. Okay, I'll try to get some to take. Last summer, um, I went to Amafi, yeah. um, and we got a limoncello from Positano. It is so good. I still have it at home. Mm. Yes, I'll definitely take some of this with me. We're going to use uh, sparkling water. Oh, you add sparkling water to it, too. So, yeah. add Prosecco? Yes, more or less, yes. So, with these glasses, 
It's not really red, so yes. you can confirm, but it's three time for the sake of two time. Three time, uh, two time, and two one time, time water. Yes. water. Exactly. Uh, yeah. Okay, and lemon. Lemon. Yeah, a slice of lemon with the salad, with the apple, slice of uh, oh. orange. Yes, okay. This is like a really famous drink. Do you put olives today? Olives? Olives? Yeah, the lady last night she put yes, olives also, in. Also, yes. But I have uh, 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 olives mm. with the uh, anchovy inside. You like it? Mm -hmm. If you like it, you can put with anchovy. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. please. Thank you. Mm. You're welcome. <laughs> No, I, because the traditional one is just a, a big olive without uh, anchovy. Yes. Okay. Okay. So with anchovy, how you have? Oh no, I have the normal one. Which you, which you want? You prefer? I know. 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 What do you prefer? <laughs> you are the with, chef. For me, with anchovy. Okay. Prefer, but but it's not really traditional. This one came from Spain. Ah. Okay. okay I bought from Spain this one. But uh, yeah, because I went to Spain in uh, Christmas. Oh, nice. To see my grandparents there. Ah, uh, your grandparents live in Spain. The parents of my girlfriend. Ah, uh, okay, your yeah, in laws. Yes. I'm still in love with Filippo's kitchen. I cannot take this with me back to Houston. <laughs> Okay. You want to make three? Yeah, four. <laughs> I keep thinking. No, it's true, it's true. Which one I keep thinking. No, bro, he really no, don't drink. No, no, yeah, no worry, man. Oh, we no. fuck. I was it, like, I, it, I, I think it, it was free, and this is was for me. <laughs> you know? Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. It's okay. Voila. Water. Sparkling water. And lemon. Cool. See, now I'm telling you what to do. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is your kitchen. I want to take this to Houston. This is his kitchen, is magnificent. Thank okay, you. Okay, guys. Wow. Voila. Gracias. Okay, this is in Murano glass. Okay. 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 Thank you. Yeah, from my family. <laughs> Thank you. 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 Thank so you speak French too, Philip? Yeah, see, si, oh. because I've been living in Paris. <laughs> ah, okay. I've been living in Paris. I speak a little bit of French as well. Well, I just introduced myself in French. Ah, uh, yes? <laughs> That's it. Right. <laughs> Nothing more than that. <laughs> so me, I work uh, like a chef in Paris for four, four years and a half. Okay. In a restaurant? In an uh, Italian and French restaurant. In Mori Venice Bar, Italian restaurant. Mm -hmm. And that I work uh, for a chef uh, open a bistro called uh, Yannick Aleno. Oh, a big one. Okay. Yes. And also for Christian Costant. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yannick Aleno in Pavillon Le Doyen? Uh, no, this is, uh, this is uh, the. Michelin star. No, I work in a uh, bistro. Okay, the bistro. It's called Terroir Parisien. Yes. Now they close. Uh, it's a Eric, good one. I'm Eric Fréchon. Mm. Eric Fréchon. Uh, oh, press the button. <laughs> oh, this is a different kind of blender. Okay. Do it like this, a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, continue. So continue. Oh, you gotta keep shaking it. Okay. It's okay. They're making you cook for us today. To play a bit. We is ready. So okay. we just uh, add olive oil. Mm -hmm. So we do it. Uh, actually, mm, yeah, we can do it here. It's, uh, it's better that we can use this for other things. It's better because this is I uh, use more for uh, pasta. Okay. Yeah, we we use this. Yes. 
So you added the olive oil before you added yes, the... Yes, olive oil, oil. before you, you turn before it, it on, on temperature. Okay. So we have the, the induction, so it's gonna be faster. Mm -hmm. yeah. We add the uh, aromatic herbs. Okay. So when you use aromatic herbs, use... If you use these herbs, so rosemary... Yes, I love and, rosemary. Uh, yes, you can use on the first step. Okay. If, when you use the fresh, uh, like the um, parsley, mm -hmm. coriander, mm -hmm. basilic, better when you finish to cook. Okay. You can keep um, the color and don't gonna be bitter after the okay. taste. So okay. for this aromatic herb, before. Mm -hmm. okay. For the other, it's like parsley okay. and parsley. And if you use um, congelated, uh, congelated uh, yes. yeah, fro frozen. frozen. Better. If you use frozen, you use first or at the end? In the end. Okay. In the end, yeah. So do you leave the rosemary in a pot or you cook it yes. with the whole food? Yes. Okay. Because I never do. I always take it off. Mm, no, you you put it here. Mm -hmm. You you leave it like yeah. this. Mm -hmm. So if you take off the, the flour of the herbs, okay, okay. because the or the butter or the oil mm -hmm. um, take off the the, the, the taste. Like in uh, Indian cuisine, they used to cook in a boot and offer the curry. Mm -hmm. okay. And uh, they put it, uh, the mix on the beginning of the recipe, you know, after. Uh, they start okay. with the curry, with the butter, and uh -huh. after add uh, the milk or cocoa, cocoa mm -hmm. milk. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it smells so good. Okay, and we start this. Start. I'm about to have some good food today. Ah, yeah. uh, I can smell the rosemary already. Oh, you want to shine there? I know, because I'm short. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you get to get them there. Right. So oh, so you won't get home, baby. Oh, I smell the garlic, the rosemary, the olive oil. So, you have this sausage? Yes. You cook in a hand, you take off the skin. So, you just, uh, I show you one, uh, one. Because I have uh, another one over there, so I'll show you how to do it. So just waiting because I forget. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? We're not cooking, but we'll get home. He's cooking, he's cooking. <laughs> yes, because they're taking from a professional chef today. <laughs> oh, this uh, is so good. You have this, this. Oh, okay. It's a little bit burning in my face. All right, so we take off the... And we cook like this in the middle mm -hmm. yeah. for take off the, the skin. Okay. We don't want the skin. Ah, okay. Voilà. You have a. You can take a knife there. <laughs> Kelvin is a chef in it up today. <laughs> chef Kelvin in house. <laughs> chef Kenny on work. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You got it? You press by, by hand. Oh, my hand is in the video. Voila. After we do it like this. Yeah. <laughs> it's look like easier when it's you. I know, right? He do it so fast. Oh, uh, you make it flat? <laughs> okay. It's okay, it's okay. You're doing a good job, Kelvin. Yes, yes. <laughs> I, do it, I do it faster. Yes, he well, does you. it for a oh, living. But after, you know. <laughs> but he does it for a living. Yes. You're just figuring it out yes. today. That's not my job. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> That's not so far from your job. Huh? What does he do? I'm a plastic surgeon. You're a plastic <laughs> surgeon. <gasps> you didn't even say that. He said it so calmly. <laughs> okay. And you just mm. press and after you cook. Okay, yeah, press. There you go. And we add inside. Ah, and then you put to the thing. Okay. okay. Right. You're doing a good job. Inside. No wonder why you're so gentle and focused. 
Take your time. <laughs> I know, right? What do you do, Leah? Uh, me, I'm a forensic doctor. Oh, nice. Uh -huh. Nice, nice, nice. And you too? And you? Um, I'm a project manager. Okay. okay. Uh, Sarah Junior. Sarah Junior. Okay, nice. So, water. Thank you. And then we have the famous chef in the house. Really? <laughs> <laughs> we have great people in the house today. I know, right? A lot of educated people in the house. Perfecto. Come on, put it in the pot. Fresh. <laughs> okay. Put inside. <laughs> Perfect. And this is the buy we buy of the market okay. too. Okay. Is a mix meat of beef and pork. Okay. okay. And we add also inside. And the sausage is pork? Pork. I have pork? more sausage for more taste of fat. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But uh okay. it's okay. C'est toujours 100 grammes de flour pour each uh, for uh, for uh, uh, eggs. One eggs, 100 grammes de flour. Ah, uh, okay. In um, okay. So, uh, what do I do? You want to do it this? You take eggs. So for 300 grams, three eggs. Three okay. eggs. Okay. Ah. Voilà. Another, another two. Oh, no, that's I don't put salt in the pasta okay. when I, I put salt after the water. Okay. But here with the lasagna we can put a little bit of salt because so we don't have, we don't cook on the water. After. And when you use the kitchenette, you use faster, slower, middle? Uh, no, not really fast. Okay. Middle, uh, you need just to mix, no, uh, okay. not too slow, not too, but no, 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 yeah, yeah, the medium. Okay. Mm. Okay. So one gram of flour, three eggs. Uh, one hundred of flour. Uh, three hundred of flour, three eggs. Okay. Yes. No, I need to know how much that is in pounds. Three grams is how many pounds? Does anybody know? What's the rule? I I wrote the recipe too on the oh, okay. US uh, scale. Skill, please. Skill. Yes. Please. <laughs> no, no, no. Sorry, yeah. I, what to do. I can send you. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. I'm doing a good job, aren't I? There's more than everywhere. Let's make sure it's still there. Okay. When it's 
start to be drier, yes. we can start by hand, but slow, okay. slowly. So, <laughs> My personal chef. Yeah. I can't believe that was an egg at that time like that. Mm -hmm. Right? Strange. It's very strange. It's not first on Sunday. It turned into a whole. That was the air white that turned into a whole. Um, foam like a whipped cream or something. And then you're gonna like, you gotta, you should see your face right now. Your face is so serious. <laughs> <laughs> okay, chocolate. Ready? One, two, three. Voila. That's like easy snack for this. That's it. Thank you. 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 Okay, you, reset it. Okay. Put it in there. It does taste though. It's not flawed. Yeah, right. It's not flawed. It's not flawed. It's not flawed. It's not flawed. It's not It's not It's not flawed. It's not then you bend it. You have to bend it to the, the both ways. But you have to come together. When you bend it, you have to come together. Then you change your duration a little bit. Okay. You have to make the two edges long. Then you put it back. Yeah, then you put it back. It was still warm. Yes, right. You have to grab it from under. Okay. Put flour, small flour. You have to rear another two more again. You gotta always change it. Yeah, you're doing okay. Yeah. I'll see. That's true. Okay. You see, it's very relaxing. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. You always snap the pull flower on it because you have to rear, you know. Small. You rear you have to, you got to do it again. Put it back. No, I changed it already. Stir. Mm -hmm. So the next time you change it yourself, okay? Okay. All right. Go small flour. Now you have to, you have to cut it. No. Turn it around, turn it around, you you mold it again, but you have to change your, the direction. One step, only one step. Okay. There's no crunching. Okay, I'm going to put the other one back in. Yeah, and cut it. Then you cut it. I'm not going to the back of the machine, right? No. Okay. No, measure it. You don't use gas. Yes. Don't throw the piece after we can use it for this mold. No, it's okay. 
I'm not the perfect doll. I'm going to make it keep perfect. Oh, that looks so perfect. Put some flour on that one, too. Yeah, I remember going in the back and I'll put the flour on top. Oh, we're working for flour. Put this on you one more time. Yeah. Oh, yes. Sorry, I'm on my own. No, 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 no. Take your time. I'm just really proud of myself right now. I have to say that out loud. You have to measure the color. Don't forget. Put flour on it when you're dead. It's already there. Yes, you're done. Good job. Good job. Congratulations. Yes, yes it's, it's good. So now we take off this part, okay. this, this thing. This one? This, this part. Oh, this little stuff. Yeah. 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 Y
up there. <laughs> okay, okay. Both of them are the same. Yeah, I know, right? The bum looked. Yeah, he's telling the person I have 40,000 followers. <laughs> he's like telling the guy how many followers I have. Well, thank you. <laughs> Okay. This palace over here is uh -huh. it was the palace of Giacomo Casanova. Mm, you know Ooh, the, the term Cas Casanova is very yeah. Italian. Uh -huh. He was a poet, a scientist, but also a lover. Mm. No? So sometimes when we say Casanova, we are speaking Venetian. Oh, okay. uh, Casanova was Venetian. <laughs> Photographer, introduce ciao, yourself. Ciao, ciao. What's your name? I'm Devin. Devin. Not the, I get on focus. Yes. Yes. Here you Not go. Not the most Italian name of all times. But yes. I call Devin. Yeah. Yes. That's our photographer. And He's in a good job. He's from Venice. So we're in St. Mark Square. You guys ready to see this, babe? What do you think about the place? <gasps> oh, spectacular! Ah, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey guys. So we're in St. Mark Square. This place is spectacular when i tell you it's spectacular i'm gonna turn the camera around so you guys can see you ready to take our photo together okay oh um, I'll, I'll be back okay so we're almost done but here is the square that's the church that's the bell tower all the way and then these are like the castles and all the buildings let me turn the camera around so y'all can see it because i love this place so much Chanel. The red? Yeah. No, uh, it's uh, a little clunky. Yes, please. 1986. 1986. Yeah. Whoa. She's a 1986 Kelly. She is. She is gorgeous. I don't want to misbehave, but she is a gorgeous, gorgeous beast. Are you ready for a little video? Yes, because I Mario am. Mario is a great singer. Huh? Okay. Io spero che un sogno così non faccia di più. Poi d'improvviso venivo dal vento rapito e mi trovavo a volare nel cielo infinito. E volavo, volavo. 
felice, più in alto del cielo e ancora più su, mentre il mondo pian piano svaniva lontano nel blu. Tanto per me volare, oh, cantare, oh, 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 e nel blu dipinto di blu. Yeah. But we got the cups and the wine and everything. Oh my God, this is just, no wonder why everybody do this when they get here. Y'all now I understand why everybody does the gondola ride. Everybody does this, cause it's so romantic. We get our glasses. Ooh, let me grab one, honey, here you go. Thank you, thank you. We about to get some wine on. And then that's our photographer Devin in the house. He's also our bartender right now, <laughs> so he's very serious. But are you enjoying this, bit? Yeah, nice. You had a good time. Yeah. It's your birthday. Out to a great start. Mm -hmm. Who's the best trip planner ever? You. You don't do it. Now we're trying to give us that credit. Every chance I get. Mm -hmm. Ready? Yes, we are. Ready? Woo! Happy birthday. Happy birthday. There you go. But anyway, the lady first. Huh? Yes. Ladies Even first. It's, it's, it's your birthday. <laughs> Gracias. Oh. Gracias. Okay, you're Now he need to serve you. It's okay. It's your birthday. tranquilo. Gracias, gracias, David. Okay. Finish everything. Okay. This is a sweet Venetian wine. Okay. This is my love. It's the best. The wine is so good. Uh, I feel like this is our birthday. No, bro. His birthday is not till Sunday, by the way. But we're here for his birthday trip, so I feel like it's our birthday. Oh, this is so cute. So, this brings us to the end of Venice vlog. Um, tomorrow we're up to Florence and Tuscany, so I'm gonna end the book then and vlog here. I hope you enjoyed this video because we had such a good time recording it. Um, we're gonna go to Venice for, to Florence for the boo birthday. <laughs> so we're gonna spend the whole time there. But yeah, if you enjoyed this video, please hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell and you'll receive every single cousin I post. Um, I tried to do all the other day thinking on my Instagram, so hopefully you check that out. Uh, personally, I we're only here for two days. We're not here for too long, so we leave from here we go to Florence. That's where we spend the third of our trip. So you'll see a lot of Florence. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. We had such a good time in Venice. This food, this time around, the food. <gasps> So good. Like I feel like when me and I came, the food, I don't know what we're doing. We're in not a touristic area. That's why I think we didn't enjoy the food. Now we took a cooking class as you guys saw earlier. The food is still over time. I had a good time. Babe, did you have a good time too? It was good. Yeah, I think so. Okay, I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Ciao!